Hi, everybody. I'm James Cebulski. Welcome back to EA Sports. It is a huge game at stake for both sides tonight. Game five. Let's go. And we are about set to drop the puck on this one. Coming up here. The goaltender is quickly off to his bench to get the extra attacker out. There's the whistle, and here's the call. The Senators will serve two minutes in the box. Cleveland's man advantage unit will take to the ice for the first time tonight. For the scoreless game, James, an opportunity to go up by one. They'll want to gain possession right off the draw and set the tempo. Denies him on the play. Handles the pass from the right side. From the neutral zone now. Takes a shot. Turned aside with the glove by Greaves. Special teams so important. Can they capitalize on this power play here with a faceoff? Curry's won the draw here in the offensive zone. And just got a piece of it to keep it out. What a fantastic save from a high danger scoring area, James. And I mean, he's bailing his team out. They have to do a better job of protecting the middle of the ice. Trying to get the puck out of his own end. And the puck's out of harm's way. Picks up the feed. Time ticking away here on this man advantage. Keeping it simple and creating some speed, but they have to gain entry fast. Cleveland's power play comes up empty-handed. We're back to even strength on the ice. Well, the power play had a ton of ozone possession time, but it was all perimeter, and they didn't find ways to move the coverage. It was easy as a PK you to just stand in that box formation and not move. You have to find ways to create some motion and pull the coverage outside the dots. Grabbed along the board by Sokolov. Makes the save. Receives the pass. Down the left wing, across into the offensive end. Oh, it stays out. He got a piece of that one. Pokes the puck away. The Monsters will play it in their own end. There's the whistle icing the call. Big face off looming. Inching closer to the midway mark of this period. Still looking for our first goal. Back underway, and they take possession here inside the offensive zone. Puck possession right off the draw, James, against a very tired group who just iced the puck. Leads to an opportunity. Reaches out and uses the stick. The Senators pick up steam and are on the attack. Quick feed down low. Into the corner now. Quick feed to Pearson. Cleveland's got it along the wall. Great defensive effort breaking up the pass. Looking to make something happen in the offensive zone. Can't maintain possession after that hit. Levels them with the hit. The Senators move the puck in the defensive zone. Grabs it in his own end. Off the left wing and into center. Good heads up play in the defensive zone. Broken up with a little physicality. To his teammate. Shot. It's in. He scores. What a beautiful play as they catch their opponent flat-footed on transition and they create the numerical advantage. Odd man rush, perfectly executed. Speed, puck movement, and of course, finish. The Senators are first to light the lamp tonight, and let's see where it goes from here. There's been some back-and-forth action, and you have to believe that sometimes when there's one, there's more to come. Gaunt takes possession after that center ice face-off. Cleveland's in transition. Here's a feed in front, and he denies that great opportunity there. 
We got a stoppage. Let's get the call. Well, they have the lead, and now they've taken a penalty. So now they're going to be back on their heels. That power play is going to come out. You know they're going to be smelling and tasting blood, James. The PK unit, they got to be the task. Another chance here on the man advantage. Well, in a one-goal deficit on the power play now, you have to take advantage. You have to find a way to get the coverage moving and find good scoring opportunities. And a successful clearing attempt. Here's a short pass to Sillinger. Shot! He stopped it! What a save on the play! And there's nothing technical about that. That is all about the will to find a way to make that save. Incredible, James. Well, the penalty killers are going to have to be the task on this one, protecting that one goal lead. The Monsters roll out their man advantage unit, and they've got lots of time with this five on three. In a five on three, you have advantages all over the ice in the offensive zone, but you still can move. You can move and isolate players. When you do this, you create movement, more opportunity. That's exactly what you have to do. The Senators take over on possession. Puck move back to center, forcing them to regroup. Quick pass to Gauntz. In close! Denies him in close. Love the way the goaltender gets tight to the shooter here. The puck's in a low slot. You want to take your time, you want to take space? Goaltender does it, makes the save. Another big face-off look as this power play rolls on here tonight. Here inside the defensive zone, they get the puck. And they get that puck down the ice. Join the penalty kill as they remain shorthanded. One last rush here on this power play. Looks to set up at the point now. The Senators get back to even strength as the penalty killing unit delivers. The next shift is critical, James. They had the opportunity on the power play to get back in it and get the equalizer. Now they're down by one, so they have to manage some energy here, and they have to dictate pace and get back in the game. The Monsters win it. Melville's got the puck. The Senators cross the blue line and are on the attack. Stopped by the goaltender. That's an incredible save, James. I mean, he's got presence in his crease, and he's also got a great glove hand, and he shows it right there with that save. Sokolov's relied upon to generate chances for his team. Curry's won the faceoff deep inside the offensive zone. Oh, and he gets in front of that, could make a great save. Does a great job with some great pushes to get to the top of his crease and make the save from a high danger area. Pokes it away to stay on the attack. Carries it into the offensive end up the middle. Passes over to Godet. Gaining momentum along the boards. Throws it in. Belleville's got it in their own zone. Boucher's got the puck. Huge steal in his own end. Cleveland's been working hard all night, James. They've been intercepting pucks at a great stick position, and it's been a defensive clinic. they got to find ways to get to the other side of the puck and generate some offense. Moves it to Malatesta. The Senators gain possession. Oh, and that closes them off against the wall. Slides the puck over. I don't think anybody was hanging on to the puck after that hit. Cutting to the front of the net. Wide. Score! I believe that's his first career playoff goal. Well, it is, James, and it's going to feel pretty good because there's a lot of question marks around players who can't get it done in the playoffs, and he finds the back of the net. That's going to give him a big confidence boost to send him through the next game. Melville's taken a two-goal lead already here in the first period. They look dominant tonight, Cheryl. Yeah, they've been terrific tonight, James, and they've been able to execute. They've thrown a lot of pucks to the net, but they've managed it extremely well. They've opened up their own lanes, and they've got the opportunities. are real deflators for the entire team. James thought he had a piece of it and it just dribbles into the back of the net. He wants that one back.
Cleveland's got themselves a goal back, and they're right into it once again. Well, it only takes one to reset the life for this team, and you can certainly see it as the bench erupted with that goal. Gaunt wins the draw. They'll go to work offensively here. Good heads up defensive play as he extends the stick. Larson's got it in the defensive end. Rocked him in the open ice. Crosses the puck loose. Moves it quickly over to Gaunt. Steps inside the attacking zone down the left wing. Turned aside with a glove by Mendeliz. Getting into the later stages of this period. Cleveland's shown a new energy over these last few minutes. They got one back, but they still need one more in order to tie. Gauntz has got possession. Let's see what they can do with it now. Takes a wrist shot, and that's deflected off someone in front. Quick feed to Clayton. Handles the puck at the point. Great heads up play with the stick by Saulnier. Takes the pass over. Great reflexes there. Well, the shooter's in a coveted spot on the ice, right in the middle of it, with a good look, and he makes an incredible save by getting square to the puck and turning it aside. The setters will glide into the dot. The Monsters win the draw. Through the neutral zone and along the boards, here they come. From the right side and up the middle. Scrum along the boards as they battle for the puck. Solid check to slow him down. Here they come on the attack down the left side. And now he moves it quickly to Ostapchuk. Fires away! Denies him on the slapper! Puck scooped up by Pilon. Here's a shot! Here's a shot! And he catches that one with the glove. The Senators have created a lot of scoring chances tonight, and they lead it here late in the first. They take possession as he locks him up off the faceoff. And that carries off a body in traffic. And he shut the door on that last play. Here's a short pass to Curry. Nice save from point blank range. He does a great job of having sound positional play based on where the puck is on that low inner spot. And he makes himself big, takes away the holes, and makes a save. And that's turned aside by Greaves. Carries the puck through the neutral zone. Here's a shot! Shuts him down! That's blocked! The Senators will play it from the defensive zone. Period number one in the books. First intermission entertainment is on deck here. You can also have time to go grab a drink, grab a hot dog, and we'll be back with period number two in moments. Be sure to attend our Auto and Light Truck Show next weekend and get a sneak peek at here's models from the world's top automobile manufacturers. Well, let's see what period two has in store for us as they are about to drop the puck. The second stanza is underway as the puck is dropped. Let's go. Well, Cheryl, already a third of this one played. What do you make of this one? The Senators are putting on a shooting clinic out there right now. Real entertaining game to watch. The coach will be real happy about being opportunistic and taking shots. Cleveland's got the puck in their own end. Wicked blast! We got a whistle as the puck goes out of play. Lots of hockey left to be played in this period. Bellville's got a slim lead. They lead it 
The Senators take possession here inside the offensive zone. Comes up with the steal. Tries to the crease. Big time glove save. Goaltenders work so much on their reaction time, and man, this is just a clinic right now as he flashes the glove and makes the save. The Senators continue to lead here in this second period, looking strong offensively. And they win the draw here in their own end. Moves it on over to Pihon. Referee signals penalty coming up here with a delayed call. Whistle blow stopping the play. Well, when you're looking for the equalizer, it's tough to take a penalty and play shorthanded, James. You gotta find a way to get to even strength so you can generate some offense. The Senators will have a chance to get on the power play for the first time this evening. First power play opportunity for this team. It's going to start in the face-off circle, getting possession with the win, and then looking to set up. Oh, what a save in front! Nice play, shorthanded as they get control of the puck. Taken by Sabrango. Oh, that's a really tough break for the tender, James. I mean, listen, when structure breaks down and there's all kinds of stuff going on in front of you, you can't track, you can't get your eyes on the puck, and it winds up in the back of your net. The Senators make their way back to center now, boasting a two-goal lead here in the second. Uh, and you can certainly see that they're playing more relaxed, much easier when you got a two-goal lead here, James. But I've liked everything about their game tonight. They've been creative, they've played free, but they've also been defensively responsible. Melville's moving it into the offensive end. Shot! Oh, Stopped by the goaltender. We'll get a face-off after the puck stays covered up. Sokolov's been lighting the lamp with this point streak, playing so confident. He knows where he is on the ice, and it just seems that every time it makes its way towards the net, the puck's going in. Curry's won the face-off, and now let's see what they can do. Oh, and somehow he gets a sliver of it and keeps them at bay. This is an impressive save right here, James. I mean, there's a ton of net front presence, and so a lot of traffic that he has to battle through to find the puck, and he does, and he makes a nice save. And makes the save. Oh! Picks up the puck in his own end. Carries it across the line. Angles it over to Malatesta. And they'll be forced to regroup as the puck leaves the zone. Cleveland's got it in their own zone. Right through center and into the offensive zone. The Senators take possession in the defensive end. Quick pass to Betts. Oh, what a save on the one-timer! bellville has got the lead here early in the second period. They have been the more active team offensively. The Monsters win the defensive zone faceoff. Surprise him! He got all of it! Ref blows the whistle as the puck's covered up. Belleville's message was clear coming into this one. Lots of shots on net, and they lead here in this second. And they take possession. Nice job tangling him up on the draw. Cleveland's got control of it now from their own end. Gains the zone on the left wing. Cleveland's got the puck along the wall. The Monsters have it behind the cage. Off the one corner, denies him in front. And he takes the feed. Poked away by Christensen. The Monsters have it now. Up along the wing. Along the boards, they battle for the puck. Intercepted at center by Amama. Cleveland's got the puck against the half wall. That makes the save. Mandeliz has really looked dialed in between the pipes tonight, James. He's made the saves he's needed to, and his team has been tremendous in front of him, creating a ton of scoring opportunities, and the reason why they've got a great lead. The Senators start with the puck in their own end. Oh, excellent use of the stick as he knocks that one away. Good check, frees the puck up. Picked up along the boards by Saulnier. Moving into the attacking zone. Here's a chance, sends it in front, and that's stopped. From center, they get into the attacking area. Can't keep a hold of it as he's jostled off the puck. Oh, they telegraph the pass, and he picks it off. 
Here's a chance on the attack. And that's just wide of the net. I'm sure he'll want that one back. Well, he certainly will, James, but not a lot of room out there trying to get it off quickly. And as a result, just misses. And it's a far pass to Gaunt. Melville's got the puck inside the defensive zone. The Senators looking against the half wall. Quick shot! They score! And it's back to back tallies! Yeah, and they've been chomping at the bit. Now they've got their opponent on their heels. They need a quick change here and find a way to continue the momentum. Well, it takes hard work in the intangibles to get available for a one timer in that low slot area. You know it's going to be a grind. You're going to have to fight for your space. He does a great job of it and buries it home. The Senators can do no wrong this evening, especially in the offensive zone here, Cheryl. Well, the score is a testament to the way they've been playing. I mean, they've been dominating in the offensive zone. They've had the puck on their stick. They're driving play, but they've been really urgent, even with the lead here. A great game for them so far. And he was right there to make the stop on that play. Dishes it to Sokolov. Moves it shot. Scores! They strike him. push their opponent back on their heels. They need to keep plugging away here and not get complacent. The Senators are having one of those nights, Cheryl, that everything that can go right is. Yeah, it's all going right, James, because they're doing everything right. They've been dominating play in all three zones, and they've been rewarded for it. The Monsters carry it along the wall. Mike Jane. From point blank. Scores! And look at that. The rookie gets in on the playoff scoring. And I'll talk about embracing the nervous energy. Now he can take a breath, feel good about himself, and let the creativity flow. Well, he's in tight to the net, James, and he knows that he's not going to have much time or space to get it off, so he elects to use the snapshot and beats the goaltender. The Monsters now need to find a way to get a few more of those. Yeah, they need them because if they get that pushback and they can get a couple more, they'll feel like they have an opportunity to win the game and then the sticks get heavy on the other side. But a lot of work to do to make that happen. With possession along the wall. Pulls it to the middle. Oh, what a chance and that goes off target. And the referee caught that trip on the play. We got a delayed penalty coming up. Let's see what the officials say. Sometimes it's just a product of keeping your feet moving, and when you reach and you take your opponent's feet out, you're gonna get the two minutes for tripping. The Monsters send their man advantage unit out once more. When you're not having success on your power play games, you have to find a way to out-battle, out-work the goaltender. You gotta get into the paint, you gotta find a way to get to that puck first. Chuck's ready for the draw as they continue to be shorthanded here. Cleveland's won the defensive zone draw. Steps across the line and on the attack down the right side. Loses possession after he takes a little hit. Takes it from the right side. The Monsters look to start the transition game. And a good heads-up defensive play in the open ice. Sends it in deep. Cleveland's got the puck. And now it's over to Gaunt. Takes a shot. And the traffic neutralizes that threat. Can't keep a hold of the puck after that play. Power play has expired. Well, this power play unit was stagnant, James. They didn't create any offense. They didn't get any pucks to the net. And there were really no chances. On the attack along the boards. Penalty coming up. Handles the puck. There's the whistle, and here's the call. Now you're down a bunch of goals here, James, and really you take a penalty because you're chasing the game, and you want to get back into it, but this one, this one's a tough one to take. I love the 
one set on the power play unit they used earlier. Listen, they had success, they scored, but there's so many variations off of it. I love the bumper position that can act as a decoy, allow the puck to get through to create those seams and open up those shot attack lanes. Braves has the puck and holds on for a whistle. Curry's ready for the draw on this man advantage. And they take possession after the defensive zone faceoff. Cleveland's crossed the line and on the attack. Scores! Coming up, clutch, short-handed. Wow! Well, you've got to love the aggressive nature of this PK unit. They jumped, they attacked, and when they got the puck, they found a way to cash in and convert on the opportunity. The Monsters desperately needed that one here. They did, and one of the key elements for them to have success is to support the puck. Feel like they've been isolated a lot in this game, but a lot of runway left over a period to play in order to get back in. Puck grab by Sabrango. Moves it to Curry. And too much traffic in front blocks that one. Here's a shot. Moves it quickly over to Testa. Steps inside the line. Quick shot. Piece of it to keep it out of the net. Right up the gut into the attacking zone. From the point, they take control of it. Here he is with the backhander. Stones him in front. And they keep the pressure on. Belleville's coaches will not be liking that power play opportunity as they fail to convert and give up a shorthanded one. Sometimes when you're on a power play, you can get caught cheating. And I think you have a lot more time than you do, and it winds up in the back of their net. That's a tough one. Oh, how did he get a glove on that? What a stop by Greaves. Here in the late goings of the period, Cleveland's still behind the eight balls. They trail by two goals. They win the face off here in their own end and take possession. No quarter given here as they battle for the loose puck along the boards. Poked away. Wrist shot from the slot. Blocked in traffic. And the puck's not loose. Picked up along the wall by Sabrango. Poked away in the offensive end. Too many bodies in the way. And look at this. They're really ratcheting up the intensity here. center. Penalty coming up here as the officials all over that slash. Three penalties in one period. You gotta stay disciplined and what it does is it disrupts the flow of your bench. Only your PKers are getting out of there. Belleville's power play unit puts their hard hats on as they go back to work. They've already scored on the power play tonight, James, and if it ain't broke, you don't fix it. The coach has got them all ready to go, fired up. They've worked endlessly on this setup, and man, is it working tonight. The Monsters take it along the wall. Big stop by the goaltender right in front. The goaltenders are the last line of defense for a reason, and this time, he bails his team out. Sends a pass over. That's gloved by Greaves. Well, this save looks easier than it actually is. I mean, when you have a shooter right in the slot and you know that you've got to find a way to get your glove on it, you got to be fast, you got to be quick and show those reflexes. He does that and makes the save. Angles want it in their own end. Hellville's got the puck along the wall. Cleveland's looking to break out. Sends it deep inside the offensive zone. Handles the pass. Takes a hit, he goes down to the ice and tops up the puck. Slides it diagonally to Christensen. Ten seconds left. Well, two periods down and one more still to come. Third period action right after we get a clean sheet of ice. Do you know someone in your community who goes the extra mile to help out? Nominations for our key player awards are available in the concourse in the lower seating level. Teams are lined up and they are ready to get this third period underway. 
Cleveland's penalty killers have won the draw here, and this should help kill off the remaining seconds of this penalty. Pearson's out of the box. He has a lot of credit to that penalty kill unit. Already down in the game, and your back's against the wall. This is a massive kill. You want to keep the game within reach. Ostapchuk's moving the puck through his own zone. Poked away in the neutral zone. And the puck leaves the zone. Great read with the stick. Here's a chance. Too much congestion in front. Quick feed to Pilon. Swap up. Pass back to the point. Oh, my scores! And he puts home his own rebound. Well, this is a second effort, and everyone on the bench erupts when he scores this goal, James. Why? Because he's tenacious on the play. He doesn't just shoot the puck. He finds his own rebound, and then he puts it in. That's a great play. I really like the effort on this goal, James. He gets the initial shot off, but then he continues towards the net, gets in behind the defenders who can't catch up to the rebound, and he puts it in. The Senators continue to ring up the score here in period number three. Well, it's just been a terrific collective effort. Now they're on the home stretch, and the coaching staff has a real opportunity to utilize their bench, rest their star players, and this is critical when you're in a long season. Here's a short pass to Fix Wolanski. There's a great use of the stick right there to poke it away. That's center ice now. He grabs the puck. And that's broken up in the defensive zone by Christensen. Reeves is breathing heavy after that last sequence, James. I mean, he had to be stellar in his own zone, coming up with a ton of saves to be able to keep his opponent at bay. Now he'll get some much-needed rest and some water as the puck heads up ice. Cleveland's got a hold of it against the wall. Opportunities like this in a game, James. You have to execute. He completely misses the net. Odd man rush. Broken up with the stick in the defensive end. Breeze freezes the puck and opts for the whistle. The Senators have built themselves up a comfortable lead here in this third period. Here's a change. Betts has won the faceoff. Goaltender covers it up, and we'll get a reset here. The Senators have put a lot of pucks on net, and as a result, they lead it early in this third period. The frozen biscuits dropped, and we are back underway here. Pokes it away to keep the pressure on. Oh, what a save! He stopped it! Whoa! Oh, that's an intangible effort that you can't teach, James. That's all about desperation and the will to stop that puck. Battle along the wall. Slides it quickly to Sobrango. Pokes it away here in the neutral zone. The Senators get a hold of the puck along the boards. Can't complete the pass as it goes off a stick. And that's poked away. The Monsters have it in the offensive zone. Comes up with a monster save in front. Man, is he ever quick on his feet, anticipating the play. Excellent reflexes. He's saving his team right now. Belleville's shown no signs of slowing down here tonight as they continue to lead by a wide gap in the third. The Senators have it behind the net. Great stretch pass as he connects. The Monsters scoop it up along the boards. Let's see if it's sustainable now. The Monsters have to find a way to get a couple more here if they want to try to salvage this one. Taking calculated risks, James, and jumping into the attack and pressing upwards. Now, you may give up some opportunities the other way, but you got to go for it. While the centers are jammed up, nice job by the winger to steal the puck. Quick pass to Pfizer. And tries to make a diagonal pass to Solier. Look at that hit. Maybe try to wear down the opponents here. Here's the shot. Nothing. Players work too hard to have the puck on their stick and to get to scoring areas to not hit the net. Even if they don't score, they'll get a rebound if they at least hit the tender. And this score has really put the pressure on now. On the outside to Thompson. Oh, this is... And it's taken by... 
by the defense. Looking to set up offensively. The Senators gain control of the puck. Gaining speed through center, and here they come on the attack. Moves it to Malatesta. Gaining the right jump up along the side. Here's a chance. Oh, clutch save. Mandalese does a great job of anticipating this play. I mean, it's a high danger shot. He gets to it just in time and makes the save. Moves it quickly over to Sokolov. Good use for the body on the play. Feeds the puck to fix Walensky. Gets the full use of his stick on the poke check. On the attack, they come down the right wing. There's a shot. Great glove save. And the puck stopper jumps on top of it to get a stoppage in play. Melville's been on a roll all night long, and they continue to lead in the third. Angles won the draw deep in the defensive zone. Greaves covers up the puck and will get a whistle. Well, he's had an excellent night, James, and he's been reading the flow phenomenally, and it has exactly that right there to be able to hold on. Teams are ready to go, and we're about moments away from puck drop. Curry's won the draw, and they're on the attack. Makes it look oh, easy with the pad. In front, and a stoppage on the play as the goaltender covers things up. The Monsters win the draw. Here they come inside the neutral zone. Melville's got the puck along the boards. Redirected off a stick. The game certainly isn't predictable, is it, James? As it's going back and forth, goals from all areas as players shoot from all angles and attack the zone. Across the line. Oh, he hammered him. Oh, he knew exactly what he was doing going into this along the boards, James. I love that it was a clean hit. He finishes it off perfectly. Cleveland's got the puck in the defensive end. And he slides it quickly to angle. to Betts. They gain possession here inside the neutral zone. And he slides it to Pizza Butler. Blocked in traffic. Cleveland's got a hold of the puck. From the left side into the middle of the neutral zone. Shot. And he had an answer with that save. the win off that draw. Jocelyn for the puck and it's knocked away. Sillinger's got it deep in the offensive end. Takes the pass. Takes the shot. Oh, that was amazing. What a save by Mandalese. Steps into the offensive end. Takes a shot. And that's blocked. Quick feed to Pion. Scooped up along the wall by Larson. Sends it over to Meyer. And now he moves it quickly to Clayton. Goes right to the crease! And that's blocked away. Here's a short pass to Gauntz. Takes the feed. Gets control of the puck right in front of his own end. Scrum ensues along the boards. And he hangs on to the puck. Puck picked up by Meyer. Oh, what a defile by Mandalese! They are really dialed in here tonight. This is a face-off. They'll definitely want to win here inside the offensive zone. Melville's going to start with the puck in their own end. Pass across to Curry. Melville's on the attack. Here's a feed in front. And he shuts down a great scoring chance there. of the broadcast team back in here, our own Carlin Bade. What you got going on? Sokolov's been great at generating offense, and I've been impressed with his game in this one, guys. Takes the feet at the back end. Played big in the moment there. Oh, it's another save on the play. Oh, man, he's so dialed in. 
in, makes consecutive saves there and keeps his team in it. A big draw looming here in the offensive zone. The Senators win the draw. Now let's see what they can do with it. Quick pass to Sokolov. Stop by the goaltender. A timely save is everything to your team. And this goaltender, he bails his team out. A lot on the line here in this offensive zone faceoff. Cleveland's won the draw. And the traffic jam in front blocks the shot. Fires the net and makes the easy glove save. The Senators have been the busier team in the shot department, and they lead it late in this third period. Curry's got the puck, and they'll go on the attack. Came up with the save on that play. A player should never be left alone in the slot, but man, is the goaltender to task here. Gets out in front of it and makes the save. The goaltender, they have to have talent. They have to have mobility. They have to be able to track the puck, but they have to have a willingness to find it and fight for any second shot, and that's exactly what happens here. Out battling, out willing, and you make the save. Officials are set. Players seem ready. We're ready to get this thing back underway. The Senators will go to work here in the offensive zone. Puck battle along the boards. Puck gets loose. We'll get some flow again here. shooter. Curry's moving it ahead. Big time hit along the boards and there's no give there. Oh, well, there isn't and you can just feel the rumble of the board from the back here. Just bone crushing, separating body from puck. Oh, a nice play to free up the puck there. The Senators will play it in their own end. Fires to the empty net. Can't get it to go. From the left side, moves it up ahead. Takes it to the front. Oh, what a stop by Mendelez. And there's another stop. Lee's out battling his opponent right now. He is so dialed in. He's tracking the puck, making save after save. It's about time this team starts working in front of him. A critical face-off looms here. And the extra attacker is on the ice, James. So much pressure on the center to win this draw. And momentum on their side as they win the draw here inside the offensive zone. Shoot it. Scrum along the boards. Clear it. Final horn sounds bringing this one to a close. And with the victory, now just one win away from closing out this series, Cheryl. Yeah, and there's two trains of thought here. I mean, you're up 3-2, and you know you're so close to getting through the series and clinching, but yet you're still far away. You have to have the killer instinct, and you do not want to allow your opponent in and force a Game 7. For Cheryl Pounder, I'm James Sabalski. The playoff action continues here next time, here on EA Sports.